Hello everyone, I'm in the Sasson dock in Mumbai, that's uh, the port for our fishing port where all the fish comes. Look at this plant, look at this plant, it's amazing. Wow, I love it. Look at all the roots. It's beautiful. Yes. <clears throat> we went here, here. Do you know your big water tank? Ah, over your, there the your market. Your backside very big market. Okay, your, thank you. Your shooting very nice. Okay, location. thank you very much. Which country? Italy. Italy. Italy and yes. Iraq. 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 Oh, Italy and uh, Iraq. And you what country? From India only, bro. India, that's good. Thank you. Sweden has, bro. Huh? We don't hash. No, 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 no. We don't smoke. Thank you. So there was just he was just trying to sell us ashish. I don't smoke cigarettes. I don't smoke cigar. I don't smoke shisha, and especially I don't smoke uh, ashish. Even though certain countries, certain say in the U.S. now they have legalized it, but it's just not my thing. Some people do. Some people don't. <laughs> I rather eat. I just had a. A red velvet cupcake. It was delicious. So we are going out to a market. Look at this. Come. Look at these small boats. They are the, probably the one that uh, go fishing and catching the fish in a small quantity. And this is a narva fish. It's typical of the Indian Ocean. It's so big. And they just finish up loading it. They're very heavy. Lots of kilos of fish. They were coming all from there, they were passing it to each other. I thought that it would be busy early in the morning, but still busy with lots of fish. I'm a vegan, so I'm not really in support of this fishing and killing of animals. But it's amazing. What is amazing too? Huh? Bagra, bagra, bagra. bagra, this fish is called Bagra. What is amazing is that the fish, are, the oceans are already getting emptied out of fish. And look at this port, just this port alone, just in, in Mumbai alone. You can tell very soon there will not be more fish because intensive fish, look, look all these fish. <clears throat> intensive fishing is creating a Big problem, it will affect our environment. Look, also no land, no fish, no variety. Look, another fish fell here. These fish also wanted to live. They wanted to live, they want to have a life. Their life has been cut short. And they are treated like now disposable object like trash. Look, another fall fell there. There are fishes of all size. Look over here. It's amazing. I have to admit it's amazing. It's very busy, it's very colorful. Look all these boats that just came here. Look, they are sorting them out. I don't know, I guess some are damaged, and they are lower quality, I don't know, and they are just trash. Meanwhile, they are individuals. Look at this big fish here. So you are telling me that we can continue catching in these huge amounts animals from the oceans and we'll be okay, we'll not be okay. But probably one will not be okay, I will not be around. Because uh, I'm already of a certain age. But it's an amazing, it's very busy, and it's, uh, the people are very friendly, and they like to talk, and they like to uh, greet. Look, look, look. It's a chain work. So they get, get it from inside the boat. They are stored inside the boats, they fill the basket and then they put it in this basket.
You see, you see, they, they, they store it after being fished. They store them in those uh, containers inside the boat. Then they fill the boat. Bangra. 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 Lots of kilos. 50 rupees. 50 rupees. Okay, this is like one fish less than a dollar for one fish. Small bangri. Small. Small, small one. All sizes. 20 rupees. No valuable, very little money for the life of a fish. Look, more fish here. This is not sustainable. And thank God they don't understand really what I'm saying because they will get upset. We are just, I was just, so, just in Egypt and uh, I was doing a video and I got stopped by the police several times because they are very paranoid you might say anything against uh, anything negative about their country especially against their government but here because uh, it's just a fish market and they don't really know what I'm talking about so they they're okay but they are, I'm not happy by the situation is it it's an interesting sight, but look at this fish, all dead, blood in here now. Look at this fish more. Look, look. Name? What's the name? Narba, Narba. Narba. This is Narba, so many. And you know, catching all these fish, they will not be able to reproduce anymore, make more eggs and make more fish. When there are valuable alternatives, there are many people that in India are vegetarian and they are vegan. No need to... Look. And fish are in a polluted ocean with mercury, it's not even good for your health. This is more a fish, I don't know what, maybe they are sardines. What owner? Huh? What owner? I don't understand. English. What owner? Owner, owner. Owner? What owner? Oh, photo owner? Boat of owner. I don't know. Boat of owner. Huh? Boat of owner. Boat? Boats are owner. Boat owner. Oh, is boat owner? Ah. Okay. Once year. Ah. Price once year. Once year. Boat ka price. Ah, boat price. price. Okay. Once year. Okay. Thank you. I didn't. I didn't really understand what he was talking about. Uh, so, you see fish here, on the floor, just trash. He also had a life, he also wanted to live. But, uh, look over there, here they are packing them. Look. They are packing them to be shipped. Very colorful, very colorful, but very sad. So I was saying, I would, they would not be happy if they heard me criticizing them for catching the fish. But in India there are lots of vegetarian and vegan too. There is even a religion called Jainism. Many of you know about it, that they are so concerned about not destroying any life, then some of them even walk with a, a stick and feathers and uh, something attached to it to push away any bugs, any animals, so that they will not 
step on them and kill them because they respect all of life. And that's also, I, I don't go to the extreme because unfortunately, involuntarily, you would kill some animals. But um, I try as much as possible not to end the life of an animal. Look. So it can be even a little bug, but if it's in my house, I relocate it outside. As many people do now, because every life is precious. And this lady is here, is uh, cleaning some fish to be sold. Hello, how are you? See? I don't know what kind of fish is this. Ah, ah. Kekra. Kekra. Wow. I'm sure it tastes very good because it's fresh from the sea. The polluted sea. But uh, I prefer to eat some vegetables. So this was the market, the fish port in uh, in Mumbai, very interesting experience.